Hello, and welcome to the Robotics Lab at College Park High School, or as I like to call it, Texas Torque World Headquarters. So we're just going to take a little tour of the facility. And here on your left, these are the robots from past years. We keep those on display so people can see them. And now we're coming up on that area on the left is where we store backpacks for the students. They keep them there so they're out of the way. And we're going to take a quick look at the field here. See, we had people build all those field elements. You're looking back toward the conference room and office. There are two teams that meet in Texas Torque World Headquarters. This area is where Team 7492 CAVBOTS works on programming, electronics, and CAD. And then it, we're going to turn and take another look at the field here from a different angle. The gray carpet is there at, uh, to protect the existing carpet. Now on your left here, we have the area where Texas Torque works. Uh, this happens to be the CAD area. You just passed the media station, and there's just a couple of robots. And now to your left, we're going to take a quick look at the electronics area, where they do all the wiring for the robot. And then up next here, on the left, this is the programming area. There's storage, and then that's where the programmers actually work. That's a look into the conference room. And a look back out on the field. And this area we call the assembly area. It's where the robots are put together. And there's the office for the mentors. And we'll step into the conference room right here. Uh, this room is not quite big enough for the 30 people that they often put in here. And so now we're back in the assembly area. To our left is a whiteboard that's a full wall. Now we're walking into the machine shop. So this is a pan and box break for bending aluminum and polycarbonate and some tools. There are hydraulic presses there. Uh, there's a chop saw, a horizontal band saw, vertical band saw, belt sander, disc sander, some larger tables for assembly. These were actually built as part of an Eagle project. We have plans for those if anybody needs them. And to our right here, this is a Probotics Nebula table router. It's CNC, so computer numerical control. This is a workbench that we built. This is a lathe that the team purchased and this is a Tormach CNC mill and there's our toolbox and this is uh, on loan from a friend of mine this is a Modella router and that's a micro proto mill and we'll head upstairs here I'll warn you as we go up that it's a little bit of a mess up here, though right now it's not as messy as it has been at other times. So now you get a chance to take a look at the entire machine shop area. One of the ideas here was that we don't really have that many walls or defined spaces, so things can be shifted around based on need. That's especially true up here. We do have some plans for this area. For example, a large meeting space. But as you can see, it's a little bit of a mess. 
and now we'll just go over to the rail and we'll take a look at the entire practice field area where the workspaces are for the different sub teams and what's nice about those glass windows and doors is that's where the students exit the school every day so they can all see what we're doing which is really cool <laughs> 